A pipe organ has a new lease on life at a Terre Haute church. On Monday, we told you an organ at Owens Hall on the St. Mary of the Woods campus was moving. The organ will be ready for Sunday services at the Unity Presbyterian Church. News 10's John Swanner chronicles this organ's unique path to its second life. Believe it or not, this 1960s organ was up for auction not too long ago. If no one bid on it, who knows what would have happened to it. There's no need to worry anymore as Unity Presbyterian Church welcomes the organ with open arms. Yeah, we would love to give this a, uh, instrument a home to continue to serve its purpose of praising God. A crew from Wick's Organ Company installed the last of the pipes Thursday morning. And after a little tuning, This organ will be good to go come Sunday. Don Wilson bought the organ with the intent of bringing it to his home. I looked at it before the auction and I truly believe it got bigger after I won. <laughs> but not all is lost. A parishioner approached Don about Unity Presbyterian taking the organ and after the measurements checked out, Don agreed this was a good home for this beautiful instrument. As long as you play it, uh, use it to glorify God, I'd be perfectly happy with that. The organist who will make this instrument sing is in her 90s, and Reverend Black says she can hardly wait to play it. After all, nothing enhances a worship experience quite like the sound of a pipe organ. There's just something about the feel of music. You can feel the pipe organ, and that sort of changes the feel of worship a little bit, so I think it'll be exciting to have that. In Terre Haute, I'm John Swanner, News 10. Now, Wilson said he purchased the organ for $700. Wick's organ company says it would retail today for about $150,000. Wilson donated the organ to the church, but the church had some expense to move the organ to its sanctuary. If you would like to check out the organ, services begin at 1030 Sunday morning.